Alright guys, so this is just a short video, or tutorial really, on how to allocate more memory to your Minecraft file. Now the first thing you want to do, I'm doing this on my 64-bit PC, um, you want to go to your main hard drive where Windows is installed, which is for me this one. I have two boots, but we're going to do it on 64. Then you will go to Program Files, uh, Java, where your Java is installed you go to your latest Java, make sure your Java version is the latest one, the most uh, recent one, you can just go to uh, Google and type in uh, Java download and you'll get to the site, I'll show you in a bit, uh, Google, I will just type in Java download, you will go to uh, java.com and you will get the download, so that speaks for itself, um, we will go back to where we were, the Java, you go to bin, and you look up to Java W.x. Um, let's see where it is. You got Java.exe, you got Java CPL.exe or EXE, you got Java WS, and you got Java W. You want to take this one, you want to go send to desktop. It's just a little bit easier. Right mouse click, properties, and you will find this the target location. You want to copy this, like press Control c or copy. You want to close this up, it's just no use anymore. I want to go to your desktop, I want to do new, and you want to go to text document. Now it doesn't matter how you name it, but I will just call it um, Minecraft new. Press enter, you go to the file and you copy it. No, you paste it, sorry. <laughs> you paste it. Then it says program file blah 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 blah. I've already done it here as well can see it it's almost the same um, what you then want to do is make sure how much memory you have in your PC you can just my PC I can just look into it and I see I have 8 gigabytes of RAM where on a 32-bit uh, operating system it will only use up to 4 gigabytes so you really should be messing with your memory while using the 32-bit version of Windows so that's why I'm doing it on 64 um, and you want to change this. Now what I put in the description as you might can see here it is spacebar and then some things and the first one is the amount of memory you actually get. Some say it's the last one but when you watch uh, your uh, F3 thing in, uh, in Minecraft you can see that it will actually be close to this one. I located it to f about 4 gigabytes of RAM memory um, and then it's much smoother. Normally it goes about one gigabyte, so if you multiply it by four, it's much smoother. But I will put the link in the description of what you have to do, but I will just copy this. Um, what you want, this is the part that you can just copy what I will put in the description. But this part is where your Minecraft.exe is. Make sure you install Minecraft and that you download the Minecraft.exe and you let it say in the downloads. Don't put it anywhere else, just in your download map. Then send it to your desktop as a shortcut. Then we go to properties to your minecraft.exe, which is here. And there will also be a target. For me, it's CE users, Richard, downloads, and minecraft.exe, as you can see here as well. These are the same. You want to copy this as well. You can just close it up. You want to paste it in here as well. And between these lines, you want to put this line, which is the amount of memory it will allocate to. Now for me it is like I said, 4 gigabytes. I can just close this one up as well. You want to don't, well you want to save after you did it. Um, I will just go to close this. I will open this again and you will select it all. Just draw the whole line, press Ctrl C or right mouse click and copy want to close this up, you want to go to run, which you can enable by going to properties and run, or you can just put here in the search bar CMD, which stands for command. Now you press the right mouse button on the logo of the C double point dash, right click, edit, and paste. Now the line that you copied will be placed here, and then you'll press enter. And then we'll start up Minecraft, as you can see here. You can just go to full screen mode or like a half screen, doesn't really matter. It will load. 
takes a while for me though, but that's just normal. I will start loading Mojang. You go to single player, my small thing, and you go to press F3. Now, as you can see on the top right corner, there's use memory 10%, which is about 500 gigabytes. Now it drops back to 5% of 3637 megabytes. The allocated memory stands under there, which is 2 gigabytes. Normally, the allocated memory is about half of the uh, top right thing that says 3637. Those things are about, the allocated memory is half of the memory you totally gave to it, which is logical because that is what you put in the file. Normally, the allocated memory is about 500 megabytes and the total memory that it can use is about 900. When you crash your Minecraft, you can see when you go to the task manager that the my, uh, Java W.x uh, program or uh, what's it called? Process is at the full uh, of its allocated memory, which makes it well quite of normal that it crashes. It just reaches its maximum amount of memory that it could use. Increasing that will make more use of your memory, but make sure you don't allocate more memory to Minecraft or the Java than you actually have. I have 8 gigabytes, so I can easily send 2 gigabytes to it. But my game is a bit laggy now because I'm also using fraps with uh, lower recording settings. We can just press F3 again. And that is how you allocate more memory to Minecraft. The problem is you will always have to launch Minecraft by using this the command.x. You can just copy, make a shortcut to your desktop with the link like I did. Just copy it and press command and you have a shortcut to here. So I hope this tutorial was uh, like clear and you understand what to do. And if you want to know something or didn't work for you, just leave a comment and um, I'll try to come up with a uh, idea that will fix it. So thanks for watching and um, yeah, please leave a like if you uh, if you thought it was useful and I will see you next